hello guys welcome back to my tutorial series on how to insert update and delete data into database using PHP and MySQLI in the previous video we have successfully added the functionality to insert data into the database so in this episode we will add a functionality to display data from database into our table so without further delay let's move to our video and here we have to display the data we have successfully inserted in database for this we will write we will go to our text editor and we will go to our table of listing all the names after the first tr we will write the code to list all the data so i'll i'll start a php insert php i'll just add dollar i'll just copy the code to connect and select database from add action page this is our connection and selecting database code so i just copied and pasted here then i will write sql query to select data from our database select all asterisk means all so select all from tbl underscore users then run query dollar result is equals to mysqli underscore mysqli query then dollar con that means connection then dollar sql that means sql query or die underscore error if query is successful then we need to display our result here result holds all the data from database uh, in an array so we will use a while loop to display all the data so while inside while loop we will declare a variable and fetch all the data fetch underscore s of dollar result as i said earlier dollar result holds the holds all the value from database in an array so we have to get all the value from result so i'm using mysql underscore fetch underscore sop to get all the values from result so i'll just create a variable that is id is equals to dollar row th that is this row then row then type the column name name no this is id then first name is equals to dollar row underscore name then last name last name after creating and storing our data from database into this variable we need to uh, display this variable in a uh, row and column so i will just copy uh, i will just uh, copy all this and put it uh, here to display so i'll just end my php here and p and cut this part to so I uh, here so it will display all the data in our table here I will have to start PHP then echo dollar first name similarly PHP echo dollar last name save it and let's see in our browser so we have successfully listed our data in our database but the serial number is showing one we have to 
generate it automatically it should show one two and three serially for this i'll create a variable called dollar sn is equals to one then i'll just increase it with one for this i i will php then echo dollar a plus plus so this will display in serial wise that is one two on online 88 i don't know what is the a that is a that is not a that is sn save it and this is just this is the one two three so we have successfully added and listed our data into the column let's add another one that is sagar guru then add member so it has successfully added the new member similarly i'll add another one that is pramit and thus and click add member so we have successfully added our data into the database and displayed in our form thanks so much for watching this video if you like this video don't forget to like share and subscribe if you have any confusion related to this video then don't forget to comment below i'll reply as soon as possible in this episode we have successfully added a functionality to display data in our table from database in the next episode we will add a functionality to update and data in our database if you don't want to miss the next episode then don't forget to subscribe so see you soon bye bye